global freight demand is estimated to triple between 2015 and 2050. The ability to move goods efficiently has become the lifeblood of economic development, particularly in cities. But cities produce around 75% of global emissions, and as they continue to grow, increasing demand for urban freight presents unique challenges, from congestion to air pollution and traffic accidents. To tackle these challenges and meet climate goals, cities can apply sustainable principles to move goods. Eco-logistics promotes clean, safe, efficient and sustainable urban freight through stakeholder engagement, regulation and innovative technologies. How can local governments transform their urban freight systems? Here are eight foundational principles of eco-logistics. Last mile deliveries account for one quarter of logistics supply chain emissions. These deliveries can be made more sustainable by using non-motorized vehicles and electric vans. Delivery trucks are disproportionately responsible for traffic injuries and fatalities. Governments can regulate for safer vehicles, speeds, streets and behaviours to reduce the likelihood of road crashes. City policymakers should incorporate the design of freight systems into urban planning the management of curb space for freight vehicles, waiting and loading zones, and shared use for deliveries are some common areas that require integrated planning. Small urban consolidation centres, in combination with electric vehicles and cargo bikes, can enhance the energy and cost efficiency of urban delivery. Local governments can provide infrastructure to support appropriate consolidation and distribution activities. With ever-improving data collection technologies, governments can better understand the freight movement in their cities and make informed decisions. Sustainable urban freight requires active engagement and stakeholder support in both public and private sectors. Urban freight roundtables and forums should be established for efficient and targeted discussions and negotiations. New business models and innovations may radically change the way the logistics sector operates. Policymakers should introduce pricing incentives and procurement policies to support the use of low emission vehicles. With the ever changing landscape of e commerce, local governments should use communications channels and campaigns to raise awareness and encourage consumer behaviour change.